All right, so if you're on YouTube, you're probably very familiar with brain rot content, whether that's on YouTube Shorts or whether that's on actual YouTube videos, it's much more common on YouTube Shorts. But you, you're probably familiar with what brain rot content is, and even if you don't know what it exactly means, you probably just understand the gist of what brain rot is. It's basically videos that are extremely hyper edited, hyper stimulated videos that uh, mainly towards you know children because children consume that content a lot more than adults like adults aren't gonna watch like you know hyper stimulated shorts I mean they might but it's mainly targeted towards kids and this sort of content is a lot more dangerous than you think let me tell you why so this content is again only targeted towards kids. You're seeing funny pictures move on screen, or you see these like really, really weird ass edits. All of this stuff isn't really supposed to be targeted to adults. Adults might find it funny, but it's targeted towards kids. And I don't mean to be one of those people who <laughs> is always like, oh, Gen Z's, Gen Z's fucked guys, Gen Z's ruined. But like, it's honestly starting to get to that point because these videos are literally seconds long. These videos are seconds long, and then the kid scrolls onto the other video, and the video is completely different. Also, it's a completely different topic, and that kid's brain completely forgets about the topic that he just watched, and he's on to the next one, and he's on to the next one, and he's on to the next one, and he's on to the next one. And obviously, like, you know, kids aren't smart enough to know that that shit is bad, right? Like, even I included, like, if... 12 year old me was watching that content, he would find it funny. He would find that content funny. He would see nothing wrong with that. So it's like, they don't know that it's a bad thing. They think it's completely normal. Kids scroll, like, you know, if an adult watches YouTube shorts, he knows that, okay, yeah, it, that adult knows that they're doing something bad, but they don't care. They, they know that they're doing something bad, but the kids don't. The kids literally don't. And I'm talking like, I'm not just talking about like eight year olds, I'm even talking about like people my age, like 15, four, I'm 16, so like people 15, 14, 13, like I guess that's sort of my age. Those people, like even those ages, it's harmful. It's much worse than you and I think it is. Like I, I don't think we're gen like prepared for this because I feel like it's going to get much, much, much worse with the, um I guess, promotion of TikTok and YouTube shows, like YouTube shows. Two years ago, YouTube Shorts was nothing. Like, I literally remember two years ago, no one cared about YouTube Shorts. Now, all of a sudden, it's like the huge hype. Everyone's getting onto it. Admittedly, I've also kind of gotten onto it. And now it's like, and then you know, you've you got TikTok, which has been blowing up after, like, after 2018. And it's like, the, they don't even have the attention span for 20 seconds of a video. How are they going to go out into, into the real world? like doing assignments like you know obviously when you're 13 you don't really have school stress or anything but like how are you going to do assignments how like like big big scale assignments like projects how are you going to get like you know do interviews like you don't even have the attention span for 20 seconds of a video how the hell are you going to hold a conversation with another person that's going to dictate the you know a chapter of your life being a job how are you going to do that if you're just mindlessly scrolling, how are you gonna, you know, talk to a girl if all you're doing is mindlessly scrolling? How are you going to do all like, you know, the things that are required for humans if all you're doing is just scrolling, scrolling, and scrolling? And I'm not like meaning honestly, this is nothing against you know people like kids who watch that stuff because they're kids. They don't know what's bad. They're kids, right? Um, but I do have a bone to pick with you know some of the content creators who just make like you know brain rot shorts. Or like brain rot content and you know, think it's like funny or they only do it to grow their business but it's actually causing a lot more harm than they think because you know a lot of people have this mindset of like oh you know business is business you can do whatever you want to gain money like whatever that, that's up to you but like I think if you're harming and you might call me crazy like I'm, I'm honestly I'm kind of starting to sound like I'm crazy but like if your content consists of literally harming like the next generation in a pretty bad way which is going to linger on for years and years i i think that's i i think that it takes it a bit too far i think that crosses the line in my opinion and you know it's it there's there's obviously a lot more rise in that sort of stuff and you know even like people my age even like some of the people in my college are literally like 
they can't even like stand still. They can't hold still. They can't like just pay attention to the teacher. The teacher talks for like two minutes, and then the next thing I know, half the class is literally playing a game on their like laptop or on their phone, like again scrolling on like a social media. And I f I feel like this is again. You might call me crazy. I'm I literally might sound insane to you, but I think that this is a lot more dangerous and is going to be like it's going to impact us like humans for a very very long time because in 20 years the people like 13 year olds people my age are going to be you know ruling the life uh, ruling this world we're going to be in the workspace we're going to be you know having jobs we're going to be the ones like at our prime age of like you know tw 30s 20s and i just don't see how we're going to make it there i just I, I i just really don't and it's it's frightening it really is and you know who knows maybe i'm wrong but i i feel like it's going to be a really really tough time in the future and don't get me wrong i'm not perfect i catch myself slipping all the time in fact this morning i literally woke up i took my phone and then for like two minutes, I was already on Instagram. I was like, what the f- Like, how, how am I on Instagram already? I literally just woke up and I was like, yeah, this is a problem. I need to record the, I need to record a YouTube video for this. So yeah, let me know if you agree. I, I mean, I might have just been yapping there. I don't know. But I feel like this is a very, like, dangerous problem. Uh, you know, like, you know, short form, high dopamine videos. That's why I don't, uh, that's why I usually, you know, tend to do these, you know, just authentic one-to-one -one videos. I don't like, I don't, you know, go into that nonsense of like, you know, brain rot, like fast edits, boom, 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 dopamine, edit, 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 um, cut, like text all over the screen. I don't, like, I, I sometimes use text, but that's as far as I go. And yeah, it's, I, I just feel bad because, you know, I, again, I don't mean to sound like really old. <laughs> I'm probably coming off like that, but like, 10 years ago, 20 years ago, when the you know, social media didn't exist, kids were on their bikes. Like, they were going outside, they were exploring nature, and they were, like, they were doing wholesome things. And now, it's sending Instagram reels to each other. <laughs> you know? And, I don't know, I just, I don't think, I don't think that's good. I, I, I really, really think that that is, you know, come back to us uh, in 20 years. All, all the things that we're doing right now, all the things that, you know, people my age are doing right now is really really going to come back to abide us so yeah let me know what you think maybe i'm going crazy but yeah comment down below what you think and i'll see you in the next video